ask Tom on home show. Lori from Sheffield Lake, Ohio has a question about a shower remodel. Well, they're just remodeling theirs for the very first time, Tom. And Lori writes, this is indeed our first time. Our final mud pan was completed about three weeks ago, and getting the proper pitch was not easy. There are a couple spots that needed to be corrected, and I'm wondering, what is the correct product to use? We're, we're about to make our curb with AC Stucco base coat, and uh, since we will have a lot of this left over, can we just use this product to kind of skim float the areas on our mud pan to make our pitch better? I don't know if I'd use it. I, I guess you could. You can use a lot of different things. You could use sandcrete. You can use, gosh, vinyl concrete patch. But usually if it's a tile shower floor and you're getting ready to, it's going into the tile phase, what you do is you mix up a little of that thin set. This way you're sure not to get an incompatible product uh, put between the two. And at the same time, uh, you're not buying an extra product because you're going to buy the thin set anyway to set the tile. So what you do is you do your final skimming and your final uh, laying out of the slope with the thin set that you actually lay your tile in. If that means adding a little bit the night before and just filling some low areas and letting it set overnight, great. If not, if you can do it with your, your quarter inch square notch trowel and not get the tiles too deep in some areas and level those tiles out, that's fine too. But usually the night before, you'll just mix a little bit up that you're gonna to use to lay your tile and just fill those low spots and then just smooth it out and let it, let it harden overnight. That's it. It's easy peasy. Yeah. All right, you got a question like that? Tom can help you out. Go visit homeshowradio.com and click on that blue Ask Tom button and Tom will uh, answer your question. You can send us videos, you can send us um, written questions, pictures, or whatever. We're happy to do it. The more you can send us, the better Tom can answer your question. That's the point. And then we post them. Tom insists on doing one every day. And we post them at homeshowradio.com, our YouTube channel, of course, our Facebook page.